Good morning, everyone, and welcome to today's video. Today is clean out, and we are cleaning out to create a amazing place for me. So I'm going to be working with herbs, and I'm going to be working with making all kinds of tinctures and lotions, and I'm turning it into a place where I can store everything. I'm really excited on this adventure. I'm somewhat getting out of homesteading. Homesteading did amazing for many years, but I'm not really interested in chickens. I'm not really interested in a lot of canning and things like that. I'm going to be working with herbs and making my own little potager, which is all of my herbs out there. I am going to be working all winter out here. We'll be filming out here, and it's going to be my very own special cozy place. But to do that, we have to do a lot of physical work. It is extremely hot and it's 90 degrees. We're gonna get this done, get all the old out, and start with fixing it up. All right, we'll see you in a little bit. I am exhausted, my arms are shaking, my legs are shaking. We worked so hard and we totally cleaned it out. Now what I have to do, <clears throat> we worked so hard, we got rid of a lot of stuff. So now what I wanna do is in the next episode, we're going to be cleaning, we're going to be putting up some new things, we're going to be decorating, and we're just gonna be doing a lot of organizing. So I have cleaning to do, and I'll show you here in a minute what it looks like now, but I have cleaning to do organizing but i'm calling it a day today i'm just exhausted so i'll see you guys again on the next one all right it's a little bit dark in here i don't have the lights on so we're gonna work on this area and we're gonna turn this into a nice little studio where also i can work on some business projects but we have a lot of work yet to do now it's time for a shower I never in my wildest dreams thought that it would take me five days to complete this project. So what you're seeing is day one and day two. This was the biggest project I have ever done. I was just so exhausted. Before I start with day two, I want to have a brief intermission just to show you what we do in the evenings. So in the evening times, we just stop all of our work and we just have a nice time. Our daughter and her husband, they only live just a block from our home. And of course, our other daughter, she only lives about a mile and a half to two miles from our home. And our son lives a little further, but we are always doing stuff with our children, which you know. So we are just going to go ahead and make some hot dogs. Now, my husband had some of the pine fat wood and he put a few too many pieces in it. We're getting used to that. It doesn't take many pieces to have a great big fire, but it's so nice to relax in the evening time and we are creating our own little mountain cabin here at home. We actually see a lot of wildlife now. Of course, you know that we have foxes, then we have deer, now we have deer. She rode her little e-bike up and there was a deer crossing the road. Her husband and her, they, they like to take walks every day and they go past her home and like to see all of the things that we're doing as improvements. She's also doing major improvements at her home as well. And I'll have to do a video on that. I think you would really enjoy that. So we're going ahead and we're gonna make some hot dogs and then we are gonna go into day two. 
because day two was just as much work as day one, which really surprised me. I really had no idea how much work was going to be involved in the 20 by 20 shed. Now the 20 by 20 shed is the original 1963 shed that was put on the property. And we totally fixed it in the outside and then in the inside, you won't believe the transformations. Now of course that is going to take a couple days for you to see because it's a lot of editing and it's still a lot of work and I'm still doing some things in there to just make it look a little bit better. So let's eat some supper and then we'll go with day two. Well everyone, this is day two. I had a really good night's sleep, but I have a lot to do in this video. Now, of course, I'm adding this video to the original video that was the day before. First thing we gotta do today is clean. So we have to do a lot of cleaning before we organize and before we get things back in place and make this into a studio. So we have all of this that needs to be cleaned out this is my bookshelf. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean each one of these up, put the books in here, and then I'll show you what it looks like when we're done. Now all of the books that are going in here are my craft books. So this is no cookbooks, just craft books. I'm gonna finish that up for this video. We've got a lot of videos to go, but at least I got this area done for today. And I'll meet you back here for the next one. So this is the before, and this is what it looked like when you saw the beginning of the video. And now I'm just gonna give you a sneak peek of what you're gonna see on day three, coming up here really soon. So I don't want to give it all away because it's a lot of work, but now we're on day three. This whole area is going to be trans transformed. You will not believe when I'm done. It only costs a couple dollars. I only got a few things, but 
I just can hardly wait to show you and tell you exactly what this place looks like. You won't believe it. It's absolutely transformed. Somebody could live in here when I'm done. So that you'll have to see because it's a lot of work yet that we're going to be doing 